Look, everyone knows how talented Sop is. And if you don't, go check out his new album that dropped this year, Few Good Things, or his magnum opus, Care For Me, which is one of my favorite albums of all time. I noticed some similarities in sound between Kendrick Lamar and Saba, and so today, I'll be explaining that. Check out this interview Saba did for Pitchfork four years ago about Kendrick Lamar's song, The Hard Part 2. It's a five minute song, and it's just straight rap. There's no hook, there's no anything else, but it's like he's doing like all of these inflections and all this crazy shit with his voice and with his flow. And what's crazy is we didn't even get to the part where he started really gassing this shit. Saba talks about the different voices Kendrick has and the amount of flows Kendrick can do. And we can definitely see that in Saba's projects and I'll pull that up later. Let bygones be bygones, but where I'm from, we bygones and more guns to give to the young. I'm living the life of a nigga, trap nigga. My uncle doing life inside prison, he wasn't rap too tight. He told me rap about life. And my uncle was locked up at the time and he told me damn near the exact same thing. <laughs> so Saba actually said this is the very first song he ever heard from Kendrick Lamar. And so he had no previous thoughts or bias about who Kendrick Lamar was. And as you can tell, he immediately connected with the content. I can find my time with bitches, just to find my time in bitches, just to coincide, just to go inside, plus it's not like what you live in. Mix the mastermind, took the mastermind, took the perfect time, just the mastermind. That shit is crazy. I wonder if he knows how fire this shit is. As you can see, Kendrick started gassing his flow, as Saba said. And both of these artists love jazz elements in their music. And I like to say they go double time whenever they speed it up. Here's an example of Kendrick going from this. What is a woman that really hurt? A demon, you're better off killing her. What is a relative? Make a repetitive narrative song how you did it first. To this. The new Mercedes with black G wagging away from it was all for rap. I was 28 years young, 20 million in tax, bought a couple of mansions, chefs for practice. That was Kendrick Lamar on United in Grief. Now let's see how that compares to Saba's song Grey from Care For Me, where he goes from this. The best song was probably on the B side. Won't be surprised when the label be not the so grey. To this. Careful me, carefully, back with more clarity, back like consecutive. I told you more fuckers like Oedipus had to be sweet in the morning, painted that paint like a portrait. Whether that's the jazz elements or the flow, it's very clear these two are some of the best in the game when it comes to delivery. What do you think? 